And now let's move on to your next bout of the evening for your men's super flyweight division. First from the blue corner, Gonzalo Garcia Duran. <laughs> This bout is scheduled for eight three-minute rounds. Fighting out of the blue corner, he stands five foot six inches tall. His record: 18 wins, 29 losses, and two draws. The fighting pride of Torreon, Mexico, Gonzalo Garcia Palos Duran. And his opponent, ladies and gentlemen, from the red corner, he stands five foot three and a half inches tall. His record, perfect 12 wins and no loss with seven knockouts. Fighting out of Buenos Aires, Argentina, Fernando Daniel El Pumita Martinez. And here we are, ladies and gentlemen. The first round is about to take off. Beautiful work by Fernando.
None of these guys is really feeling each other out. They're going straight, straight for the kill. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, into the first round. What have you taken from the first round, everyone? So far, it's, it's action pack. Nobody's filling each other out, you know, and uh, as you see, it's not going to go the distance. You know, I can see Fernando, he's just pressuring, 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 and dropping bombs, you know. To me, I just, you know, you just need to slow the intensity down just a little bit to find a shot because he's missing a lot of shots, you know. He's got a lot, a lot of energy and maybe it's that nervous energy coming out. So as the fight, as the fight goes on, he, he will find, find his group. So that brings it in to round number one. You know, if you, if you notice the corners, um, the guys with the ice that's getting really cooled down, they go and perform better. The guys without are more. Just watch the difference. From the first fight, you notice what was going on. Very interesting. And then yes. here we are again. Shot around the back of the head there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Round two. Good body shot. I can say I don't think this, you know, this, this fight here is gonna go the distance either. You know, Garcia is investing well to the body, and I love a fighter who goes yeah. to the body, you know. His intensity, his ferociousness, I think he's breaking his the, the other fighter will. You know, Fernando is a sitting duck right now. You know, he's... Uh, not doing much, and there's nothing behind his punches. Yeah, it's looking a little bit one-way traffic at the moment. Exactly. Oh, good shots there by... Like I say, it's not going to go the distance. Garcia know what he what, what he's want to do, and he's manhandling him right now. He's, he's really being dominant, and that's how you break a fight away well by just, just keep on going, you know? And Fernando is just, again, I know he's not, not enough activity for me. Look at that. I think the referee is going to stop this fight. Yeah. There's Martinez. Fernando Martinez putting him up against the ropes. Looking a bit different. Looking a bit desperate, excuse me, from Gonzalo Durant. I just think if Gonzalo really get him against a rope and put a barrage of punches together, the referee would stop the fight. Yeah, yeah. Jab there from Martinez. You know, one thing my old trainer used to tell me, you don't get paid for overtime. Yeah, very true, Lenroy. Very true. 
So if you, you know, you don't play with overnight food, you know. You <laughs> and he's, this guy's overmatched, you know. He just need to press the gas a little bit more, he's getting him out of there. A little more dividend to the body, he's getting him out of there. He's trying to load up too much on the hook. So far, you know, I got a uh, Gonzalo winning. Fernando haven't won around yet, even though he's just run two. But he need more activity. I can see either this referee, this gonna be a hurdle stoppage, either by a knockout or by the referee. Yeah. Some of the replays here, and I think it's going to be, yeah, I think it's going to be Duran not looking too happy in that corner. He's almost, yeah. he's, he's almost giving some excuses out there. Gonzalo just need to keep the pressure, just like that. Get in the corner and just put a combination together. Referee will stop this fight. Beautiful. Duran doing his best to, to try and Try and come back, but, and it's Martinez with another good shot downstairs, then comes upstairs. <laughs> Referee's looking closely at the moment. There it is, oh, beautiful shot. hook. Again, if he catch him, keep on putting the pressure and put a combination together, the referee will stop yeah, it. Yeah, if he puts his foot on the gas, I think it's, I think it's good night, Vienna. Yes, because look at the referee's eyes. See that referee's watching yeah, him. he's looking very, very closely. I just, you know, believe that, you know, with, with what's going on right there, um, Gonzalo just needed to stand in front of him and just press the gas because this guy cannot hurt him. He, he cannot hurt him at all. There's nothing behind his punching. See, he just got to stay there, and the referee will stop the fight. He's a stronger man. He got more velocity behind his punches. He's quicker. So back at it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sorry, you, uh, we, you, the, feed, uh, the audio feed dropped for a moment, ladies and gentlemen. So our apologies there, but we are back. Myself, Adam Noble Forsey, and Jamaica's baddest man, Leroy Thomas. What do you make of the fight so far? So far, I got Martinez uh, being dominant. Um, if I was his corner, I would advise him just 
pressure him, get him on the ropes, and let his hand go because he have no respect for this guy. This guy cannot hurt him. And, you know, if you pressure him and put a combination together, the referee will stop the fight. We're watching the fight. We're seeing the referee eyes. He's just looking for a good shot to step in. I see in the replay, look at the referee eyes. You know, he's ready to stop the fight, but again, Martinez is not putting really a really lot of your punches together. You can see the referee mouth. Ooh, exact, going, exactly. But yeah, it looks very talented, Fernando Martinez. Yes, yes. But, Le but great, great, great show by Legacy thus far. Oh, know. excellent show so far. It's been action packed so far. Still to come, ladies and gentlemen. We've got some. Some of the world's best gracing the ring tonight. Anthony Sims Jr. Jr. takes on Hernan David Perez. Mike Perez takes on Tony Salam. And Austin No Doubt Trout takes on Alejandro Davia. You know, I think if Martinez put his foot on the gas, you know, he, he would stop this guy, honestly. You know, work him to the body a little bit and finish off up top. Just like that, stay there. You can see the referee is looking to stop this fight. He's almost looking for an excuse, isn't he? Exactly, yeah. exactly. Ever thought about getting a haircut like that, Lenroy? <laughs> no. <laughs> maybe in your younger years? Maybe, maybe so. Yeah. What if, what if one of your children came home with a haircut like that? Oh, man. You know, the funniest thing is um, if I was uh, healthy enough to perform on this show, I'd probably do something crazy because uh, Jamaica, we just had over independence yeah. um, on August 6th. So, you know, that would be real big. And for what we're doing in the Olympics right now, you know, Jamaica is, is really dominant right now. So I, I, I would consider it. Justin Martinez, man, just if he really put a series of straight shots together, he, he can get this guy out of there. Yeah, sending out a, a warning shot to the super flyweight division. Got, got seven KOs in his 12 wins, which is quite a decent KO ratio down at this weight. And I believe he can, he can get 8-1 tonight, too. See, again, more, you need more. You know, single shots is not going to do it. Come back with the right. And he's, he's looking for excuses, isn't he? Giraffe. He was complaining about a shot to the back of the head. I did lovely shot. I can see the referee stopping this fight right now. He's looking. He's hurt. He is. Mexican. Stop Lovely it. Shot. Here it comes. Here and it comes. The referee stops up yes, there. yes. I can't disagree with that. I can't really disagree with that. Well done. Well done. And like I said, he could pick up his eight and he got it tonight. He got it.